lot of people have been asking me about my camera gear, so let's take a minute and talk about it. First thing I need to do is swap this camera out so that I can show you the camera, so you'll see the quality change quite drastically. Okay, let's talk about this camera. This is the Fujifilm X-H1 mirrorless camera. The actual way that I get that look in my videos is with this lens. See, this is a Helios 44M lens. It's an old Soviet made lens, which is actually made for old film cameras. And so what I have is this adapter, which basically turns it, which basically allows me to use it on my mirrorless camera. So the reason I use this lens is because this lens is famous for its background blur or as it's properly known, bokeh. Bokeh, 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 bokeh. Basically the background, it makes the background blur like really, really stunning. It makes it like swirly around the background. And so that's why I use it. And the best part about this lens is that it's so cheap. I probably bought this lens for about $40 and it's in amazing condition. The only modification I've made to this lens is that I've taken out the clickiness in the aperture ring. Uh, this just helps with when you're moving from different light sources, instead of having very sudden changes in light, you get a very, you can make it a very smooth transition from light to dark or dark to light. The only problem with this lens is that it's completely manual. So there's no autofocus, there's no auto aperture. I have to go in and set everything up before I step into shot. On top of that, this camera doesn't have a flippy out screen. That's about as much the screen goes. So I have to basically kind of, <coughs> I have to guess where I'm going to be standing and I have to kind of guess the focus or I'll use an object, which I'll put where I'm going to stand and then use that to focus on and then step inside and then do my shots. It also means that my TikToks take a lot longer than it would if I was using autofocus and all of the automatic functions of the camera. But to be honest, for the look that it gives, it's totally worth it.